Each day it gets a little more real. The meet exceeded all my expectations as far as like how I swam, but also just I had a great time. The meet was super fun. My teammates were so supportive. My family was there. And now the championship final of the 200 IM. You know, I had confidence going into the meet, but you know, I wanted to just have fun and compete and enjoy the moment. And that first night was a big surprise for me. That was not what I expected at all. Right there, there's Nelson. Boy, she's giving her everything here. She actually outsplit Easton there, 32-3 to 32-6. Competing against the fastest woman in that event ever, who I had looked up to and watched swim like, well, swam next to her last year, and she obliterated an American record, and I mean, it's intimidating. You're surrounded by the best, and you're in the field with them. Um, and to finish in front of them is something, like, indescribable. I think Bina Nelson is gonna pull the upset of these championships. Wow, Bina Nelson of Wisconsin in lane three, 150-79. I just kind of tried to keep the ball rolling and keep that momentum going, and. It worked out for me. 49-66, the record, and she's hey! 49-18. She obliterates the NCAA and American records. Vita Nelson of Wisconsin. Here comes Vita Nelson, American record, 147.16. Yes! 147.24. No! It's a new NCAA record for Vita Nelson. And she is the only swimmer who will win three individual titles in this championship. Being able to stand up on that podium at number one with that trophy and look out and see Badger Red and hear like people cheering Wisconsin, and I don't, it's awesome. Being home has kind of made it hit me pretty hard. Seeing all my teammates, um, all the people here at home who were supporting the whole time, really, really puts it in perspective for me.